Dear students, I welcome you all to this problem solution series in digital electronics. I am solving the problems from the book Digital Design by Maurice Mano and Michael Siletti. So in this video, I am solving the problem number 2.6 from chapter number 2. So the problem is draw logic diagrams of the circuits that implement the original and simplified expressions in problem number 2.3. That means previously we have solved the problem number 2.3 the link is given in the description and the problem 2.3 finds the minimum number of literals for these expressions so from these expressions we have to draw the logic diagram for this expression as well as after simplification for this expression and similarly for b and so on so we'll draw the logic diagram one by one first problem is a b c plus a bar b plus a b c bar this is the f original and f simplified equal to b you have to see the last problem now we have to draw the logic diagrams for this okay we have three inputs a b and c so draw three lines a b and c also find their complements these are the lines a b and c and also find out the complement that is use an inverter and you, you will get here a bar so use an inverter here you will get b bar and use an inverter and here you will get c bar okay so the original expression is a b c so you will take a line from here from b okay from c you take a line from here okay use an and get and you will get here a b c the next one is a bar b so a bar b how we can draw this one is a bar okay a bar so this one is b so this one is a bar b and the third term is a b c bar a b and c bar okay use an and get because they are in multiplication and you will get a b c bar now we have to use an or get to get the summation of these three terms okay so use an or get here and we will get f original then we have the simplified simplified is directly the b so you take a line from here and this is the f simplified okay so this is the solution now we have to find out for part b so for part b we have f original was given as equal to x bar y z plus x z x bar y z plus x z and f simplified equal to z whole into x plus y we have three inputs x y and z so draw three lines x y and z draw three lines here and from that line we have to find again the complementary line this is x bar so inverter and here we'll get y bar and here we'll use an inverter and we'll get z bar here so the first or original expression is x bar y z here you get x bar and y z y and z use an and get here and you will get here x bar y z plus x z then next term is x z x z x z so this is or get the f original and then we have f simplified z whole into x plus y first of all we will find out x plus y so take a line from x and take a line from y use an or get you will get here x plus y okay then take a line from z here and you multiply with an and get and you will get here f simplified Okay, this is the solution of part B. Now let us go to the part C. Part C is F original equal to X plus Y whole bar 
whole into x bar plus y bar. This is the original expression and f simplified is equal to x bar y bar. So here we have two inputs x and y. So we will draw two lines x and y and we will use an inverter here and we will use an inverter here. So x plus y whole bar. So what we will do? First of all we will find out x plus y. x and y. These are the two lines. Use an OR gate. Okay. And you will get use an OR gate. Okay. You will get x plus y here. And use an inverter. And here you will get x plus y whole bar. Then we have x bar plus y bar x bar is this one and y bar is this one so use an or gate okay so here you'll get x bar plus y bar then use an n gate to multiply these two and we will get f original so this is the f original logic diagram now we have to find out this one is x bar y bar so now we have to find out f simplified so it will be x bar and y bar just use an n gate and you will find out the f simplified. Now let us go to part D. f original equal to xy plus x all into wz plus wz bar and f simplified equal to xy plus wx. Okay, we have four inputs here w, x, y, and z. We have to draw four lines for these inputs W, X, Y, Z. These are the four lines. And we have to find out the W bar using an inverter here. X bar using an inverter here. And Y bar from here. Okay. And this is the Z bar line. Now we have to find out the F original expression. So it is X, Y. First of all, you find out x and y multiplication that is use an n gate this is x y then x whole into this one so first of all we will find out this one and we will multiply this whole expression with x so w z w z how we will find out w is this one okay z is this one multiply it you will get w z plus w z bar w z bar w z bar now we have to add these two expressions okay use an or gate and we'll get here w z plus w z bar okay now we have to multiply this expression with x take a line from x here and you multiply using an n gate okay this will be x whole into wz plus wz bar okay then we have to add this expression with xy so take this line up to here and use an or gate and we'll get here f original then f simplify this xy plus wx xy x take a line from y multiply it with an n gate xy plus wx w w line is this one okay x is this and get wx or get and f simplified so this is the logic diagram for the part d okay now we will go for part e f original equal to b c bar plus a bar d b c bar plus a bar d all into a b bar plus c d bar okay this is the f original expression and f simplified equal to zero so here we have four inputs a b c and d so we we'll have to write or we have to draw lines for a b c and d these are the four input lines Okay, we will use an inverter here and you will get a bar here. We will use an inverter here and we will get here a bar. Another inverter and we will get here b bar. 
another inverter we will get here c bar and we will use another inverter here and we will get d bar here first of all we have to find b c bar a d bar then we have to add these two expression then similarly we have to find this expression and finally we have to multiply using an and gate so b c bar b c bar so draw a line from b c bar from here okay multiply it so it is b c bar then a bar d a bar is this one line a bar d use an and gate here is a bar d then we have to add these two okay use an or get and we'll get here b c bar plus a bar d then we have to find this expression so a b bar you find out a b bar b bar is from here okay use an and get a b bar then we have c d bar c d bar okay c d bar then we will use here an or get okay and we will get here a b bar plus c d bar and finally we have to use an and get to multiply these two terms so we will use here an and get and we will get here f original then we have f simplified simplified is zero so zero line you have to directly connected to the f simplified so this is the part e then we have the part f of the question number 2.3 we have to draw the logic diagram okay so part f then for part f we have f original equal to x plus y bar plus z bar whole into x bar plus z bar okay and f simplified equal to z bar plus x bar y bar here we have three variables that is x y and z draw three lines for these three variables x y and z then use inverter to find the complemented line or oh, this is x bar this one will be y bar and you use an inverter here you will get here z bar so x plus y bar plus z bar x we take a line from here y bar is this one and z bar is this one or get or get so here we'll get x plus y bar plus z bar then we have x bar plus z bar x bar you take from here then z bar is from here then use an or get and we'll get x bar plus z bar then use an and get here and you'll get here f original okay then we have f simplified so how will find out f simplified is z bar you take a direct line from here okay then we have x bar y bar this one is x bar and this one is y bar okay use an and get here and We will use here an or get and you'll get f simplified okay so this is the solution thank you for watching if you have any question please put it in the comment section below also like share and subscribe to my channel thank you